Hey guys, welcome back. I'm Maya. And I'm Jordan. Jordan and Maya. Do you remember when it was two jammers? She named that. If you are watching this and you've been part of the Jordan and Maya family, we should like name our like probably the same. Shout out? No, but how like people didn't like their fam. We should oh. name ours. Alright, we should oh. name ours. Alright, we should oh. name ours. Alright, what should we call you guys? We'll think about it for the next video. Which... Yeah, and you guys should leave comments, suggestions, of notes. Okay, um, today is going to be a story time about stuff that has happened up north. And there is one thing. Which is where we are. We're gonna like talk about like little stories. I think we're gonna talk about three stories. Yeah. Actually, no, four. Turtle hole, turtle, blanket, poop. <laughs> <laughs> We'll save like the best for us. No, it's not for the turtle hole first. So, yeah, actually, no, you explain the history of it. History? Hi um, well, in this swimming area of like the lake that it's we the go lake to, that. it's called Bowler Lake. Um, and there's like a hole in the middle of the swimming, not in the middle, like at the edge of the ropes. It's so, like, you know, like when you're swimming in a lake, um, there's like ropes that you shouldn't go past, but like you can. It was like right yeah. by the end. It's like yeah. this, and it's like quicksand, kind of. Yeah, and like. People like always like call it the turtle hole because that's it's where they think turtles. where like mud snapping turtles go and so far we haven't found any. Luckily, yeah, because that would be like our toes gone. Yeah. Basically, every time we go swimming, we try to find it, and when we find it, we like start drowning, <laughs> and then we usually try to freak the other person out and like pretend we're actually drowning. Okay, so that, the that's turtle the hole. first story. The second story is the turtle. Basically what happened was we were walking along the beach and all of a sudden we saw this like, I thought it was a, I was like, I saw it and I was like, wait, Jordan, hang on, let's like backtrack. It turned out to be a turtle that was like slowly dying because it was like in the sun and it was like kind of stuck in the dirt. So we grabbed it and we decided to like rescue it so we like brought it back to the campsite and her grandparents told us to put it in like a bowl of water. Oh, right. Um so then we were here for like maybe like a weekend weekend and then um I don't know. But my um our family friend was um, he was the campground host at the time. I had to name it after him, him because it was Memorial Day weekend also like today, yeah. like this weekend, and he was a former veteran, so yeah. He has recently, like a year ago, right? Like a year ago he passed away. <laughs> Blanket story. Yeah, so basically we were with Harold, and um, he has like little golf carts, but this one had like no cover over it, so it was just like cart, basically. <laughs> Um, he was just driving us around the campground, and we could go pretty fast in there, but not probably the maximum speed like 30 miles per hour. <laughs> so, um, so we were riding on this thing, and her mom gave us this blanket to use because it could get windy when you're on there. So we were there was like a hill kind of, so we wanted to put our hands up like this, and the blanket was over our legs. And we just had our hands like this. So when the hill came, we both went. Do you want to do it? Let's show them okay, what so happened. This. We were like this. We were like one, two, three. Hi. And we were like. <laughs> and then we fell. Boom. <laughs> and my mom like drove over the blanket, and we drove over the blanket too. And we were like, we could not stop laughing for like the whole day. Yeah. It was hilarious. So yeah, that was the blanket okay. story. So this is the last story. Sometime in elementary school, I came here with her, and by the lake, there's like a toilet, but it's, you know those toilets where like, it's like, like a toilet, it's a but it's toilet. like a square, pit and toilet. yeah, pit toilet, it was a pit toilet, so like I could see all the poop, and it wasn't like a porta potty like you could like literally fall into this, and like be in poop, it was disgusting. So anyway, we didn't want to go all the way back to the campsite, um, so... And I didn't want to go in there because I was like, can you at least come with me? And she was like, no. So I was afraid I was going to fall through. And keep in mind, it smells so bad in here. So um, I was like, I have to poop. It's not just that I have to pee. I have to poop. And everybody knows everyone pees in lakes. Literally everyone. <laughs> All right. So I didn't want to go. And she wouldn't come with me. And we wouldn't go back to the campsite. So she was like, why are you just poop in the lake? And I was like, you're not supposed to poop in lakes. And she's like, just poop in the lake. And I was like... 
are you sure? Because, like, I know you've been here for a while. You always go here. And she's like, I'm sure it's fine. I've done it before. Everyone does it. And I'm like, I don't think so. <laughs> so I was like, I mean, is there anyone around? And she's like, nope, you're all good. So I pooped in the lake. <laughs> like, poop, poop. It wasn't just like... <laughs> This is so weird. I don't want to talk to you. <laughs> okay, so um, so um, well, I was lying about that everyone does it. I've only done it once, and that was like when I was like five. That's like how I was. Well, like a year older. I was like six or seven. You said you were like in like first, second, or third grade. Then. Six, seven, or eight. Six or seven. Okay. Anyway, so yeah, basically that happened, and she was lying to me, and she was a horrible friend. And it was like floating. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! I bet a fish ate it. <laughs> a dog. Oh, that's <laughs> just gross. If you watch this video, guys, don't forget to like this video subscribe and comment down below what we should name you guys who watch our videos and yeah bye guys what the heck